Hello friends, my name is Viraj. Today I would like to show how to use an calendar control in ASP.NET. So let us begin with our tutorial. So just click, click on Visual Studio. Go to the new website. Add a name to the folder. I am P somewhat like. Click OK, a folder is created. Go to the Solution Explorer, right click on it, add a new item, give a name, cal1, add it, this is your coding part, go to the design, in this we require three things, a text box to show whatever date you have selected uh, image button where on clicking it the calendar will be open and we require an calendar control so add an table text box sorry and image button and a calendar these three things you require so you can if you want to change the calendar format here all sort of formats which are default available in visual studio just select any one apply it and click ok now i want an image to my image button control so add an folder give a name add a folder give a name to it img ok select an image just copy this calendar image and just paste it off you can see calendar image is stored in your folder in img right click on your image button control go to the image url image select the calendar image and click on ok if you want any sort of back color just select it off a border color or you want a border style what dot it or dash select it and give a width and height to it so that it will look properly as an image button so enter 16 16 pixels so let us go to the image button and double click on it here the coding parts begin so as you know our calendar id name was calendar1 so write a calendar1 dot visible is equal to true so when you will click on your image button the calendar will be shown or visible now right click on your calendar control here you can see it is visible so just turn off it and select from false now double click on your calendar control here as we know our text box id is text box 1 so write text box 1 dot text is equal to calendar 1 dot selected date the date which we selected dot to string select a format for it so we require 
small dd capital mm and 4y date months and year now again write a code calendar fun dot visible here you have to select false because in image button one you have selected it true so that shows that when you click on your image button the calendar will be shown and after clicking your date this calendar will automatically not visible so just run it so click on your image button select a date as you can see ddmm by by format 58 2017 so if you want to show date with time so let's go back to your design part here also we require three things a text box image button and calendar select any sort of format apply it click okay go to an image control image button select image url click okay adjust your height and width go to an image button click on it enter a code calendar 2 as we know now our calendar id is 2 dot visible is equal to true so on clicking on your image button the calendar id which is this this is your id for your calendar 2 you can also change it true now go back to your calendar right click on it go to the property and select here you can see visible is true select here as false go back to your code right double click on your image right double click on your calendar 2 write a code date time dt is equal to convert convert dot to date time open bracket close bracket enter here calendar 2 dot selected date dot two short date string open and close it time spam t s is equal to new time spam open bracket close bracket date time dot now dot r where r are displays date time dot now dot minutes will be display date time dot now dot second will be display now right 
dt is equal to dt dot add ts value of ts and dt are joined together or you can say add and it is stored in dt enter the text box to where you want to show date and time text box to dot text is equal to dt dot to string open close here they will show and select your calendar to dot visible is equal to false just run it click on it see your month your date your year is shown and with the time so if you want to show this on a label control let's get back to our design part select and label right click on that label here you can see the text label just clear it off as you know your id is label one go back to your code part enter label one dot text is equal to d dt dot to string open close and just run it click on your image button control select you can see both the dates and times are same so here we have used only table control and here our label to show your dates and times so thanks for watching this video please like share comment subscribe it thanks for watching it bye